Texas. Well, if they weren't, we wouldn't be at AK-47 Stadium here in Hexon, Texas. Bring your body armor to the stadium or wear a body bag for the ride home in the hearse. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Cleveland Burns take on the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV oh, and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. There was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there, but other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. I saw their kicker warming up his leg before the game, and uh, it smelled delicious, Bricks. Yeah, those kicker legs are meaty. touchdown man once he saw daylight he was gone the kickoff team didn't even know what hit him okay nice and easy like a two-foot putt you miss two foot putts all the time Grim. the kick is good They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. They run it for a yard. And that'll bring up third and one. Pick six, but dropped the interception. And it plays a defense, schmuck. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. They're going for two here. And the quarterback calls a son. And perfect pass for two points. That's a 
that piece of art right there, Bricks. Yeah, Grim. The QB turned the defense into an abject mess. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for it. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offs. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. First and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. And he fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Bricks' match stuffing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. somehow and hold on for the first down. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. Second down and a muffin says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. and load baby welcome back hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show obviously they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it or they can start cheating and killing that's what i do when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay
You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. Broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like another big porta John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and he intercepts the ball. Thank you very much, Justin Defender. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Can't think it you. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks. And he finds his target for two. Man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... E oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It's a punishing hit! And it's first and ten. Oh, now the offense is getting kills! Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys! It's fantastic! He's at the ten! Touchdown! Hey, if you kill a ref, it's not murder if they have it coming, right? Take the hit, do something about that ref, you pussies! I won't even get out of the The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again! The offense defense says enough of this BS and jumps offside to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Second down and ten. Well, feed five, foul, foul. target more often first time out under two minutes the chess game has begun it's like chess only you can kill people
And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve defense. Cole Cook speed. Man, that defender just turned on his jets. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in. Oh, what a brutal hit. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the NFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. Yo, guys, suck. And this is a first and long situation. Oh, no, it's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? Man, what a hit that was. <laughs> and the defense uses their second timeout to stop the clock to preserve time for their offense. And it's first and ten. free and has open field in front of him and he scores see that move baby i'm the greatest no you didn't see that because i'm too fast <laughs> Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Point break. Because if you can't answer your question with... His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He scores! you never know. It's good. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. Open bricks. Yeah. <laughs> and the Oilers just got spanked. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left by halftime to forget the game and start watching the new game of bones on NBO. You know, I watched that on my phone too. Oh, Let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the MicroHard Corporation. They get it right every other time.